what's going on guys tj here welcome back to the channel today is going to be a kayak usa mothership this is day one actually uh me and my wife say hey we're gonna be demoing it. This is day one, so we're gonna be removing the seats, the carpet, anything we're not gonna use. We're just gonna, I brought her out here. She's gonna help me. I told her we're gonna demo it out today. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Why do you have the freaking chainsaw? You said we were gonna demo No. Up. Please put the chainsaw up. Holy crap. Wait, we don't need a chainsaw. <laughs> no, we don't need a chainsaw to remove carpet and seats. I mean, I'm just Holy like crap. Are you kidding me? Whew. This is gonna be day one. We're just gonna remove carpet and seats. We don't need a chainsaw. Good morning. It is uh, the next morning. It actually got really dark on us last night, and so we had to kind of call it quits. We was running out of light, and we didn't want to drag a bunch of lights and stuff out here. But it's Sunday. It turned out to be a beautiful day. The storms never hit last night. So as you can see, we've got everything stripped off except for the carpet. And I just I couldn't sleep last night because I was thinking of all the cool things that I'm going to do. And you know now that I got to walk around on it and see different things, I, I'm figuring out what I what else I'm going to take off and put on. But I'll show you the pile of crap that we've pulled off of this thing. We have got like look at this, <laughs> all all of that. We're just kind of chunking it off in the driveway next to the boat. And the carpet's pretty bad, but we haven't found any soft spots on the floor. So, I, I don't know. I'm debating on, like, if we rip this carpet up and the floor is solid, I might not replace the wood under it. I might just patch where, the, you know, the seat holes and stuff were and just carpet right back over it. And I'm also thinking about removing, like, unhooking the gate here, the rail that goes out. 
and it's the same length over here on this side so it would be even on both sides if i unhooked that and just putting a, a big platform up front for you know we could drag the kayaks up on or whatever we like i said we i have i i just couldn't sleep last night i was thinking about all the really cool stuff that we're going to do to it but what we're going to do right now is you got to see us strip this thing out now i'm going to break the pressure washer out and i'm just going to pressure wash the crap out of this boat i'm going to do the pontoons i'm going to hit the top really good and i think i'm going to do the floor before i pull the carpet up so that it's not as nasty and i can find the screws and stuff to, to get out and i think the pressure washer would help me out a lot with that so let's get the pressure washer out here Just like that, we have got the carpet pulled up. We've got all the seats out. I'm gonna show you guys how it turned out. We still gotta go back and get the screws and and like pieces of carpet, these little fixtures and stuff that are in the floor. We're gonna get all that up. But look at the mess we've got over here. Look at that, there's the carpet. It was disgusting. We got it all up. The floor seems really good. I'm gonna set you guys back down so I can talk. The floor seems pretty solid. It does. We hadn't found any weak spots. It's just, uh, it's just really dirty. All the black stuff you see is just the glue from the bottom of the carpet. I'm gonna go back and we're just gonna pull off this, these little circle things and all the screws that we find in the floor. We're gonna get them out, cut the rest of the carpet up, finish pressure washing. And after that, we're gonna let it dry for a few days and check the floor out again. But I think the floor is gonna be good and we're gonna end up just probably carpeting or putting uh, linoleum down. We're not sure which way we're gonna go yet, but we've got a lot of cool ideas. We've been sitting here talking uh, we're going to put a built-in cooler, a uh, propane tank. We're going to get rid of that gas tank, and we're going to have a, a little shelf with a fold-up table back there. A lot of really cool things that we're going to do, and I'm going to have to go write them down so I don't forget. But if you're watching this, you're following along with this video, you have really cool ideas, throw them in the comments. Let me know. I'm taking notes. You know, I'm taking notes of all of your guys' ideas because I want to make this a really cool. I don't want to miss out on anything. You know, I don't want to look back and say, Man, that guy had a good idea. I wish he would have told me when we was building it. Let me know in the comments. We'll do it. If it's a good idea, we're just gonna go with it. And hopefully by this fall, we're gonna be camping out on this thing out on the river and, and you know doing some mothership in the kayaks for wherever we wanna go. All right, guys, so we're gonna finish this one up today. Uh, this is gonna end the video right here. I'm not gonna video myself pulling all these little screws and stuff out of the floor. But the next video, we should be laying carpet, maybe doing the lights and stuff on it. It's gonna be fun. Make sure you follow along with me. Hit the subscribe button, and I'll catch you guys on the next one.